Hey guys, what's up? I'm gonna be showing you how you can add cosmetics to your girl attack fan game. Uh, I just re um, I just recorded this, but it was so bad that I'm re-recording it. So, uh, yeah, let's do this. Uh, all right, so it's actually pretty easy. All you have to do, let's start by opening Photon VR. It's the first thing right here. Open it and drag in your player model. Then uh, drag it up like this. Make it look snazzy. All right. Now you have to uh, click the arrow uh, in the top thing to open up whatever it's called. Uh, and in here, uh, you have to add your hat model. Uh, to find a hat model, you can literally just look up 3D models. And I recommend using Sketchfab. And then I looked up hat. And uh, I scrolled down until I found this bucket hat. So if you want to follow along, use this bucket hat and make sure that you download. Uh, make sure that you when you download the f file, make sure it's an FBX file because uh, that is the only type that works. Or there's another type, but I forget the name. All right. Anyway, so now that you have your player model in like this, you just have to uh, add the bucket hat over it like this. Make sure it's lined up well. Oh my God! Come on. Thank you. Uh, make sure it's lined up well. Uh, mine's actually not lined up well, so let me make it slightly bigger. Alright, so uh, you might have to scale it down a lot because it does start up very big. Uh, so once you have it lined up pretty well, then you can shut it off in the top right here. Oh my god. <coughs> Jesus. Uh, <laughs> you have to shut it off in the top right here. Uh, you won't be able to see it, but that doesn't really matter. Alright, so make sure it's underneath the head. If you're gonna make it a hand cosmetic, make sure it's underneath. Uh, make sure it's underneath your hand or or your, your wrist joint. Uh, you can do either. Uh, I recommend putting it under your hand though; it looks the best. Uh, so yeah, now you have that. You can close out of this player thing, and you can actually just delete your player. Uh, oh my god! Come on, I'm gonna just go up. Player, thank you. Delete it. There we go. <laughs> All right. So now you're gonna have to make your station. Uh, just make a cube, stretch it out like this. Uh, this will be your kind of like where your buttons are. Then you have to make two cylinders, or you can make it two squares, uh, whatever you want. But I use two cylinders, and you have to make them green and red. Uh, uh, or you can make them something else. I really don't care. Anyway, uh, now uh, make sure that you go to the collider and make sure it's a mesh collider because on uh, cylinders sometimes it gets messed up. And then do convex and make sure it's a trigger on both of them. Uh, now you have to go to my Discord and find the enable cosmetic script. Uh, mine's right here, and I search up enable, and here it is. Uh, I would just drag it on like that, and it would be in here, but I already have it. So the cosmetic to enable. Now, uh, let me just figure out what the name is actually. Uh, by giving two player not player photon photon vr opening it dragging in my player all right so now let's see what the name is why don't another bucket hat underneath it oh why is this under my player just drag this over here there we go all right uh i'm actually gonna drag this under my game all right so now uh we know what the name is it's called bucket hat variant you can see it right there um and we're going to make sure that this says bucket hat variant underneath it why am i over here uh enable cosmetic underneath it you want to make sure that this says uh what was it called bucket hat variant bucket hat variant you can see it's right here uh yeah and then right here make sure this is bucket hat variant So on this one, my, this script's also in my Discord. Make sure this one's disable cosmetic. And if you just duplicate these, make sure that you delete the enable cosmetic. Uh, but some people won't do that. All right, so now you're done. Uh, just test it. All you have to do is go into your game, do a little slap slap on here, uh, and it should work. Um, if you notice that, uh, so uh, if it does work, uh, you can leave the video now. But if you're having problems, I'm gonna try to solve them here. Uh, Alright, so, uh, if you want this hat in the top, uh, you can just, 
uh, drag and drop your hat model. Make sure it's a new one. And also, if you want gloss around, just find a glass material and put it around. I don't have it right now, but uh, that's what I would do. Uh, all right, so the problems that you're having. If you're having a problem where you're hitting it, but your hand is above the thing, make sure that you make it into a mesh collider. Make sure it's convex and trigger. Uh, if you're having a problem that you're hitting it, uh, perfectly fine, but it's not happening, make sure it's a trigger. Uh, if you're having a problem that it's following, like, not your head and it's following your hand, make sure it's underneath the head area on your cosmetic thing. And if it's getting in the way of your eyes, make sure, uh, just move it up. Uh, I'll make a tutorial on how to get it out of your way, uh, in another video, but I'm not gonna do that right now. If you want that tutorial, just, uh, subscribe. Alright, uh. Yeah, I think that's it. So bye.